my name is Elenia. Welcome to me and welcome to Let's Not Talk Politics, where we talk about anything and everything not politics. So if you like, you can subscribe, turn on notifications, use your big beautiful brains to leave me a comment. Well, last week we had a conversation about exploding zombie caterpillars and I wish that was just me being my lovely weird self, but they're a thing, like in the real world, like this is happening. Today in This Is Why I Should Never Leave the House and Someone Build Me a Biodome, news sea lice <laughs> sea lice that eat your flesh poor young man in australia um was playing soccer decided to take a dip in the sea um this happened at denton beach denton beach in Brisbane. he jumps in and i guess he starts feeling the things on from like the feet to I guess he didn't jump in all the way but this was him kind of walking in because if you look at the pictures well like which I will not post here I'll post the article if you wish to click on it it's super gross times um the poor guy if you see the pictures of him coming out he it, it's a bloodbath from about mid calf down and he wiped away the blood and it just kept bleeding the poor kid had to go to hospital and explain to me when this happened explain to me when there was lice in the water and explain to me how it became carnivorous and where it came from and why it likes human flesh and what what how do we kill it you know what Let, let's not have a huge conversation about it how do we kill it how do we kill it without destroying other marine life? And I don't want to hear anything about how, well, it's the water and maybe, you know, it's the water and maybe humans shouldn't go into the water. How do we kill it? How do we kill it? That's what I want to know. You know what? I am, I am the bunny who when I see things that shouldn't be there, like a spider in my bedroom, okay it's it or me and it can't be me you guys it can't be me oh my god what like this video making this video even makes me uncomfortable like i'm not you know this huge like water baby type of thing like i'm not a super strong swimmer but i like the water you know like i mean some of the best times i've had um with my parents and my sister has been going to the beach in Florida and Greece, um, Cape Cod, that kind of stuff. So oh, Cuba, you know, I, I like the beach. I like the ocean. I like the water. Um, so I can't like it's bad enough that you get the little fishies that swim by your legs. Right. At some point you make peace with it and you say to yourself, OK, I'm in their place. They're not coming after me. They're just swimming on by. Right. But sea lice, how do you how do you reconcile? Do you have any idea? You hear that? That's my thigh. Those sea lice, sea lice, sea lices, those sea lice would go to town on my flesh. Oh my god, you guys. So yeah, sea lice is a thing, and exploding caterpillars are a thing, and I don't want to give you anxiety, but we have to feel this together because I'm selfish and we have to feel this together. So again, I'll link the article below. However, do not click it if you don't want to see if you don't if you don't want to see the icky things. Okay? Cuz it's more than icky, it's a thing that exists in this world. How do I end this video? I don't even know. Listen, do your research before going anywhere. Um, see if the waters have been recently tested. Do all that kind of stuff. I don't want people to stop living their lives. Um, and I don't want to stop living my life. But let's just do our research. See where we're going. Let's just not assume. Because the world's a tricky place, right? Um, please, please, please take care of yourselves so that you can take care of each other. And I will see you very soon.